And the floodlights are shining down on the players here in the Spanish capital of Madrid. We're at the Bernabeu. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And if this game lives up to its billing, we're in for a riveting occasion. It's Real Madrid, and they face Al Hilal. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? And let's dissect the Real Madrid side. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside David Alaba in central defence. Luka Modric plays with Toni Kroos in the centre of midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. at the starting lineup for Al Hilal. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. And the contest begins. Marega might really be able to trouble them here. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Not a very complicated catch for the keeper. Good vision, can he get onto this? And the keeper flings himself at the ball. Cross with the corner. Safe pair of hands, did his job. Well, a magnetic player to watch, Federico Valverde. Stewart, what part might he play in this game? Well, Derek, we know he loves linking up with other players, but it's when he's in and around the penalty area, that's when he's at his most dangerous, when he plays little one-twos around his marker and then plays the next forward pass into a runner. He could be the key to unlocking this defence. Well, disappointing that it's gone out of play. Well, the outcome is a free kick here. Deep delivery. Well, I suspected that might be difficult for the keeper, but I was wrong. Gives it a go. A goal in the early stages. Precisely what they had been planning. Yeah, here's the setup play. Well, it's a great little back heel, isn't it? But there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. So, underway again here. One nil to score. And that pass could be troublesome. Well, it all counts for naught. And good use of advantage. The referee allowing play to continue. Aldosari. Carrillo. Cuellar. Vieto. Takes the shot. Pretty simple for the keeper.
Federico Valverde. Well, no stopping him. Corner given to Real Madrid. Playing it in. A oh, splendid header, but a fine save. Not a chance for them again to play it over from the corner flag. A really effective shielding under pressure. Marega. No worries for the keeper. David Alaba. Given away by Real Madrid. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. They've given it away. Rodrigo Effective pressure to regain possession Well, doesn't have to do it on his own Is it going to be? And how well the keeper did Well, that's just exceptional He reacted so quickly there And a Real corner Hungry for more Over it comes Another corner kick conceded. Let's see what they do this time. Modric. He's got to have a go here. Determined block. And Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore. Can he play it in? High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that. And it was close. Well, his skill level is so high. You're absolutely right. That's a great effort on the volley. Abdul Hamid. Andre Carillo. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. This could square the game. And it's come off the keeper. Oh, wonder goal! Right out of the top drawer. Who could do better than that? Well, what a piece of skill this is. It had everything. Agility, technique and power. It's a great goal. So in business once more, on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. Nacho Fernandez. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Can he put them in front? Well, it was a wonderful chance, but the goalkeeper comes through. Yes, Derek, we have to give credit to the keeper, but surely he should have scored there. That's a big, big chance. It looked as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Well, the referee wasn't going to let that go. David Alaba. Camavinga. Eduardo Camavinga.
Vinicius Jr. That's a nice looking ball. Attending to his defensive chores. Modric. Goalkeeper in charge of the situation. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. Corner kick played in. And the keeper did magnificently. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? And the danger's still on. And he takes on the shot. And it's in! The back in front! Stunning scenes here! Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. Well, two one it is here. Well, he keeps going. Vieto, and the flag does go up, must have been tight. Well, there you can see Real Madrid haven't been able to control possession, but what they've done with it has been really good, and they'll be happy with the way the game is being played at the moment. They love to play on the counter-attack. Saud Abdul Hamid. Just the challenge that was required. Nacho Fernandez. And it's played into the centre. And tremendous goalkeeping. Well, he just made it so difficult for the striker. His presence alone just caused him a problem. Playing it in. Well, really stout defending there. Off the line. Brilliantly blocked. quality last ditch defending the keeper diving magnificently to make sure he got there cross with the corner and striking the crossbar And it's in! Real Madrid firmly in charge here. Well, we can see it here again, and it starts with a wonderful delivery into the box. Deep corner making it so difficult for those defenders. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Is that half time here in the Spanish capital? Well, we know Federico Valverde is capable of delivering top. And off and running again after a dizzying first half performance by Real. Will we see more of the same in the second 45? Vinicius Jr. A good effect of pressure high up the pitch. Abdul Hamid. Andre Carillo.
And moving the ball nicely. Could be! Fine goalkeeping to push that away. Well, they might be onto something. Look at Modric. It's got to be! Well, I'm afraid it goes down as a wasted opportunity. Well, no excuses. He should have scored there, and the goalkeeper got really lucky. He can't believe it. Marega. This might be ideal for the counter. Well, this would help them get back into the game. Spectacular save. Top-class goalkeeping. Kamavinga. The cross is on. Corner for Real Madrid. Delivering it. And still a chance. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Body on the line. Alaba, and a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free-kick situation? Time for a change, then. Dies for goal and denied by the post. What an important piece of defending. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? Well, they won't come much closer than that. It's a matter of inches from being a really good goal. Well, they have to have that sense of self belief. It could happen for them. Can he put it away? And there it is. Three goals in front now. An immense performance. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. So on they go again, and every indication that Real are going to stroll to victory here. Andre Carillo. Gustavo Cuellar. And the keeper more than equal to it. Valverde. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. They're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Salem Aldosari. Luciano Vieto has it. Arega. And the cross goes in. A terrific defending to stop them progressing. Marega! And quite simply, a wonderful chance was squandered. Odrio Zola. 20 minutes to go in this one. Thumps clear. The referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. But it didn't end up being a significant advantage. And so a free kick here. Well, the referee has taken note of his name and number. Well, I think he can count himself a bit unlucky there, but it was certainly a foul.
Entrará en la cancha con el 19, Dani Cebaños. Ceballos, really important piece of last ditch defending. Well, that is how to play advantage. And a decent delivery. Well, given the position he found himself in, he really should be testing the keeper. Superb opportunity squandered. Rodrigo. Rodrigo Zola. Here's Modric. Has eyes for goal. Oh, the post denied him. Well, they survived the attack. Well, I have to say, I thought that looked to be going in. It was such a good effort. Yes, a really open flow to the game. End-to-end -end stuff. Still work to do. Well, what an opportunity squandered. Far too easy for the keeper. Now we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one. Vinicius Junior. And the referee blows the whistle. It is a free kick. Salem Al Dossari. And the cross not sufficiently well played in. And what a close shave it was. David Alaba. Camavinga. Well, by playing keep ball like this, they're keeping the opposition at bay. Modric. Well, can they be creative from here? Oh, lovely ball. And effectively parried away by the keeper. Vieto. Abdul Hamid. Possession lost, intercepted. Well, a shot from miles out. A gift for any goalkeeper. And he keeps going. And a very good challenge. The referee's verdict is three additional minutes. Just wanted to get it out of there. Asensio, well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Who can they pick out? Modric, superb block. So there goes the final whistle. Real Madrid victorious, and their fans are going to be happy with this. Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest. No two ways about it. He really has brought his influence to bear on the proceedings. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today.